Whether we like it or not, winter is right around the corner and in Maine that typically means cold temperatures and a lot of snow. And while some of us tend to wait until the last minute to get ready for the winter weather, some people can't afford to do that. New Center Maine's Shannon Moss explains. It's a mild October day in the city of Portland. The leaves are changing, pumpkins decorate front stoops. Even if it was snowing, I'd leave the wing up. And already, snow plows are out and about. Pick that blade up just a little bit. Snow is not in the forecast yet. I would pick the wing here. But new city plow drivers need to be ready for it. This is the easiest way to do it. When there's nothing on the ground, um, when there's not everybody else out, and you're not in a rush. Bob Wasick is the safety and training administrator for Portland Public Works. You are driving a 14 foot wide truck with a plow and a wing um, in snow and ice conditions with the public um, weighs about 60,000 pounds with sand on it. Dave Salee has been working at Portland Public Works for about seven months. This, one? Yeah. this is only his third time driving a plow truck. I think the hardest thing about it is just understanding where the wing gets down and just understanding how close I can get to the cars. Keith Emery, a maintenance worker at DPW who has been plowing snow since the late 70s, is helping to train the new drivers. We we'll buy this car, we'll drop the wing. Emery says it's not easy maneuvering a commercial plow truck, navigating streets in a city made up of residential neighborhoods. We'll turn right. And the busy, sometimes narrow streets of Portland's peninsula. Come up just a whisker with a plow. Even when those streets are clear of ice and snow. And every snowstorm is different. Some might be a fluffy snow, but if you add a wind to it, you get drifting. Just one of the many things a plow driver has to focus on. You got to always be aware of your surroundings. And hope all the other drivers do the same. A lot of people underestimate uh, how much work goes into it. See, so now you just watch this pole. How much preparation, how much training, but we're all in this together. Teamwork. Go easy because I don't know if you're going to fit. The best way to survive a Maine winter. In Portland, Shannon Moss, New Center, Maine.